I don't know if you have felt that this winter has been pretty unusual for Idaho, but it's going to continue on this week. Two weeks ago, we saw blizzard conditions come through our area with plenty of snowfall. Last week, we saw a lot of rain come through the area with warmer conditions, and then all of these 50s that you're seeing across the board, the West Coast here, they're going to make their way over to the Treasure Valley and some other parts of Idaho. We'll look at that in just a couple of moments. Take a look at some of the temperatures that we saw today, though. 49 in Boise, 41 in Ketchum, and 49 in Twin Falls, almost up into the 50s. But heading into tomorrow, we're going to be seeing those 50 degree conditions coming in very, very soon. Taking a look at some precipitation that's going to be rolling through the area. Sorry for kind of standing in the way of that one. But we're going to see a little chance of rain coming through the area. And then by Monday, we're going to be seeing most of that clearing out. As you can see, some wind that's going to be moving uh, east to west coming through the Treasure Valley and a little bit of the Magic Valley. Let's take a broader look. I, even though I was covering the graphic the first time, we'll get it the second time coming through. You see this rain off to the west making its way over to the Treasure Valley. A little bit of snow flurry up in our eastern central mountains. And then by Monday, expect a majority of that to move on out as we're going to be seeing warming conditions expected for a majority of this week and the cool down not expected until next week. So taking a look at what we're going to be seeing our 6 to 10 day outlook. Warmer or wetter, I should say, than normal conditions expected for a majority of the states. The only dry spot, surprisingly, in places like Seattle and Portland and Vancouver, which a majority of the time they're getting tons of precipitation. When it comes to those temperatures, though, warmer than normal conditions going to be moving off to the east. A majority of the middle of this week, we're going to be seeing those warmer than normal conditions, but then a cool band is going to be heading into our area. Expect that to be happening by next weekend. We're going to take a look at what we're going to be seeing tomorrow, though. Chance of rain expected for a majority of the Treasure Valley, 50% across the board. But man, take a look at some of those 50s. 53 in Meridian, 54 in Boise, 54 in CUNA. Very, very warm for this time of year. Not expecting these temperatures at all, but there's going to be a little bit of a cool down expected next weekend. Taking a look at the rain that's going to be hitting a majority of the western and central mountains, 40s and then 30s in places like McCall Council and Cambridge. The eastern and central mountains going to be getting some precipitation rolling through their area in the form of some snow and the form of some rain, just depending on the temperatures. As you can see, 27 freezing for rain, uh, re yeah, freezing for water, I should say, and then 44 expected to be the high. So it just depends on what time it's going to be rolling through the area. Higher elevations going to definitely be getting a little bit of snow. Taking a look at what the Magic Valley is going to be seeing. Broken clouds expected for them. This system expected to roll over fairly quick. Only a 30% chance of rain expected for them. Taking a look at the extended forecast. So to start out the week, we're going to have a chance of rain expected and then going to be nice and clear as the temperatures 55 on Wednesday in the Magic Valley. Crazy to see a number like that at the end of January. But by Thursday, both the Wood River Valley and the Magic Valley are going to be seeing some precipitation rolling through the area as the temperatures, like I said, are going to start to drop. You see that chance of snow on both ends, the Wood River Valley and the Magic Valley. Taking it to the Treasure Valley, what we're going to be expecting tomorrow, 40% chance of rain to start out the day and then only a 20% chance with broken clouds expected for a majority of the day, but 53 around 3 o'clock, 54 I think expected to be the high, that's correct, 50% chance of rain and then warming all the way up to 57 on Wednesday. Whew, going to be a scorcher, break out the shorts on that day, but then by Thursday, very similar to the Wood River and the Magic Valley, going to be seeing some increased rain expected and the temperatures are going to start to drop, a chance of rain snow mix expected for next weekend and so potentially winter conditions on the way, but it's certainly going to be nice and mild, I would say, for this time of year is quite the odd winter continues on here in Idaho.